Good morning guys and welcome to day two of our cruise. So it is technically Monday and we are out at sea. Today is a full sea day so um, John and I are looking forward to just spending the day by the pool relaxing and um, going in the hot tubs and all that fun stuff and just leisurely enjoying our day and doing whatever activities we want to do. Um, and tonight is formal night, so I'm looking forward to that because I always love getting dressed up. Um, it's about 6.45 in the morning, probably closer to 7 by now. Um, and John is at the gym, so kudos to him. But um, I think that I'm going to go get some coffee because it is super early. And as you can hear, my throat is pretty scratchy. Um, I woke up this morning and... I feel like I'm starting to get a sore throat, um, which really sucks because I'm on vacation and that's the last thing I want. Um, and John said the same thing. He was like, does your throat hurt? And I was like, yes. So unfortunately, I think him and I might be getting a little bit sick. I'm going to do everything that I can to not think about it and to avoid making it worse. But we're on vacation, so whatever um but like i said i'm gonna go up to the promenade deck and get some coffee at cafe promenade and then i'm gonna go out to um the deck outside and see how the water's looking because we are officially out at sea so i'm so excited um to see what it looks like and enjoy my coffee outside and then come back hang out in the room for a little bit watch some cartoons because i'm a child and finish off my coffee while John uh, finishes getting ready and then I think him and I are gonna go get some breakfast and then we'll just go from there so I will see you guys up at the promenade deck Twelve seconds later now that is one gorgeous view if I ever saw one Alright guys, so I have my coffee and I am now out on the deck again. I am on the other side, so originally I was on the side that the sun was setting, or I'm sorry, rising, wow. <laughs> um, and now I'm on the other side and nobody's over here, it is so peaceful. Um, I'll show you guys, it is beautiful. Literally nobody. I think my favorite time on a cruise ship is in the morning, especially super early because most everybody's still sleeping. Um, the ship really comes to life at night. That's when a lot of like the shows and um, events and stuff are. Um, but in the morning, you know, because of that, most people stay asleep and wake up, you know, later in the morning, which is fine. I just love waking up early and it's always interesting too to see like who else gets up this early but it's always nice because the ship is empty and everybody's still sleeping it's quiet you can smell coffee anywhere you go on the ship and just coming out and sitting out here and looking at the ocean with your coffee is just incredible it is one of the most amazing things nothing beats cruising if you have not cruised before please go because it is life-changing honestly like uh, it's so like soul enriching I don't know for me personally I just I don't know I love it out here it's amazing that's all was just now but that little speck out in the distance it looks so far away from here and you can hardly tell what it is but it is a carnival ship it's probably the Vista which is what was in port with us in Galveston yesterday you guys i've made it back to the room which means it's cartoon time i want to say it's channel 25 five can you hit five okay i don't know what this is okay so this is the only cartoon on right now and it's really weird i don't know what it is but i don't know i'll figure out something to watch we're just gonna go with it who knows this is what having a three-year-old little sister does to you you watch weird ass cartoons yes a few pictures of me is exactly what this party needs to turn it from awesome to tranktacular that and some pictures of everyone else too
won the national This is our view going forward. There's like a little camera on the front of the ship. And then once it zooms in a little bit in the map, I can show you where we are at sea. Okay, that's still a little zoomed out. It's kind of hard to gauge, but once it zooms in, I'll show you guys. So it'll zoom in a little more, but we left out of Galveston. So we were basically right on the coast last night before we went to bed, very close to it. And as you can see here, we are now out in the middle of the Gulf of Mexico. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. And then we're gonna be going, <laughs> okay, well. Um, but yeah, so we are going in between Cozumel and this piece of land here through the Gulf and then down to Roatan, Honduras. And that is our first port of call. I'm so excited. It's nice though, because we have two full sea days before we reach Roatan, or Roatan, I'm not sure how you say it, Roatan, I think. Um, so we have plenty of time to enjoy the ship and get accustomed to the layout of everything. This is the first sea day and we're gonna have so much fun. There's so much on the cruise compass for today. If I can get it. So this is the cruise compass for today. I know you're just like, girl, that is just a bunch of words. Um, and it is, but like I said, we're gonna go get some breakfast. John is currently showering. Um, and then after that, we will probably hop into our bathing suits maybe and go by the pool. I know it's kind of early, but we'll see. I know we want to go to the $2 Mimosa Happy Hour in the casino, which is from noon to one. And then I'll talk to John and see what else we want to do. We probably want to go see a show tonight. Maybe do water slides today. That should be fun. I definitely want to go see the ice show at some point. I know they have it like earlier in the day, so maybe we could do that like after lunch or something. I would like to go to the outdoor movie. I always love watching movies in the hot tub. Um, last year they played some like really cute cartoon movie. It reminded me a lot of Secret Life of Pets. Um, it was pet based and literally we stayed in the hot tub for the whole movie and my night was made so I kind of want to go see that even though I don't know what Captain Phillips is. <laughs> this is breakfast this morning. I have some potatoes, eggs, bacon sausage, and the infamous waffles from the last ship and then this is our view. It's gorgeous and of course coffee and orange juice. And your plate looks so full. Yes, oh my no gosh. cold everywhere else. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. So breakfast was delicious and now we are just exploring the ship a little bit. We went and checked out Sabor, S Sabor I believe it's called, which is the Mexican um, restaurant on board the special <laughs> board. And now, now we are on deck three. Yeah, because this ship is set up very similar to Navigator, which we were on last year and we're looking to see where our room would be on this ship that it was on last ship. So we're just gonna go check it out. And look at the vacuum, Henry Extra. He looks happy, I like his nose. It's really long. <laughs> so I don't remember which room exactly it was, but it was like one of these rooms right no, here. I think you gotta keep going forward. No. Nuh uh, it was one of these guys. Might have been this one. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It was one of I those guys. Mm -mm, that was the corner we went no, around. It was definitely three. Five, yeah, because we didn't go that way. Yeah, yeah. Or that way. Wait, are you sure? Yep, we didn't go downstairs at all. It was like one of those. So John is going up to the pool. Pool. I was gonna say pool bar. Pool deck. And I am going to go to um, a destination meeting in the Platinum Lounge because I think it'll be fun to learn about the different ports, but John's not interested in that, so we're separating for a little bit. Yeah. But then Sadly. I'll see you 
up at the pool deck. You can't even see me. I'll see you up at the pool deck. Will do. All right, guys, I've made it. I am all alone. And they gave me, it's upside down, but they gave me a packet of some good stuff. And it looks like I got maybe a raffle coupon and a little coupon or something. Yeah, cool. Rotan, Belize, and Cozumel. Have you been in these islands before? Beautiful, beautiful islands. So we have our top three reasons to book through short excursions. The first one is convenience. You have one stop, one... We have three different... Guys, so that meeting thing, like the destination talk, um, is what it was called on the cruise compass was basically just discussing the different shore excursion options which i didn't really need to go to because we already have our stuff booked um through like independent uh like excursion um companies so it's okay it was still interesting to hear about them i guess <laughs> um but now i'm changed into my swimsuit and i'm gonna throw on a um like a top and a bottom and head out to the pool deck and probably get a drink and hang out with John by the pool and I think we're gonna go into the little whirlpool that like sits over the side of the cruise ship in the solarium so I'm pumped about that so I will see you guys up on the pool deck and now we wait I have this um, deck three. all to myself never happens so i am back in the room now um my shirt is so wet because i'm wearing my bathing suit underneath this but um we were just up on the pool deck for a couple hours we laid out um went in the hot tub technically it was called the whirlpool it like sat on the side of the cruise ship like over above the water which is so nice um and then we went on the water slides and they were crazy they were so much fun so um, it's about like 3.15 now and came back to the room because I want to get changed around and get ready for um, dinner. Tonight is formal night, so I don't know if I'm going to get a shower or not. I think my hair is okay. I washed it last night, um, so I think I might just try and work with it and then put some makeup on and get changed. And then John and I are going to go to the ice show, um, which is at 4.30. And then after that... It should be about time for dinner because our dinner time is at 5 30 so that is the plan so <clears throat> i need to get the heck out of these wet clothes i think i'm just gonna throw my pajamas on and do my makeup in my pajamas because there's no sense in putting another outfit on that i'm just gonna change right out of so let's do that right now and we're in pajamas this feels so nice i almost <laughs> don't want to get out of them but you girls gotta put a dress on and i'm actually excited to get ready and look nice because the past two days on the cruise i've looked like this <laughs> and uh it's not the best look for me so i'm excited to look nice and walk around the cruise with my heels it'll be so fun so let's get ready should be good for now we'll deal with the hair later <laughs> all right let's see if this hair is okay oh not too bad i'm surprised usually when i have it up for a while especially like if it gets even the slightest bit wet there's like a big uh hair tie mark but it's not that bad this is totally like i can totally work with this i'm happy <laughs> Now I don't have to shower and deal with hurrying up and having to dry my hair with a hair dryer because that always sucks because I have so much hair so it takes forever to blow dry it. Oh, I'm so happy. Let's put my makeup on, girl. Okay, guys. So I am all ready for dinner. I have my makeup done and I straightened my hair, but I wasn't liking the way like I wasn't liking the way that like my bangs were laying. I know that sounds so weird, but um, I decided to just put it in like a low pony so like that whatever it's whatever 
Um, and then I just have on this body con dress that I got from, I believe it was from Garage. Um, it's really hard for me to find, like, body con dresses that fit because I'm, A, so short and, like, petite. So, um, the fact that this one actually fit me really nicely and wasn't baggy, um, or too long or anything like that, or too short, of course, <laughs> um, was nice. So I have that. And then these shoes, I believe, are Madden Girl. Um, they have, like, a really cute, let me hold on to the thing, really cute detailing on the side. So these are so cute. I love them. Um, so this is what I'm wearing. I'm probably going to throw on my sandals to go to dinner not those ones like a different pair I have I'll show you um just because or I mean to go to the ice show I'm like my mind is gone but I'm gonna throw those on to go to the ice show because we have to come back here so John can get changed to go to dinner so um that being said I'm gonna go up I have to go up and find him he's eating pizza at the pizza place so i feel like i always talk to you guys in the mirror when i'm in the room just because it's easier so um yeah so i'm going to head up and find john um and then him and i are going to go to the ice show so um yeah i will see you guys at the ice show also very happy because timmy uh timmy turner timmy Timmy Neutron? Yeah, Timmy Neutron is on. So, yay! These were the sandals I was talking about that um, I'm wearing to the ice show just so that I'm not wearing my heels and I'm not like uncomfortable. And also, um, it's still pretty early. It's like 4, 4.15ish maybe. And so I have a feeling nobody's gonna be dressed up yet for dinner. So <laughs> I feel a little bit out of place wearing this to the ice show. But um, I just threw some sandals on so that way I feel a little bit more casual and then I can always come back and throw my heels on for like dinner. So, yes, see you guys there. We've made it to dinner. It's formal night and John looks so handsome. I look like trash right now, honestly. No, you don't, you look so I'm handsome. I'm slapped together. I love that flannel on you. I love it too, I just, I look like shit. So this is tonight's menu. It is formal night and I am definitely getting lobster bisque. And then I think I'm gonna do the almond crusted cod and probably just cheesecake for dessert. And I always love every night they have fresh warm bread at the, at the table, it's so nice. Okay, so the lobster bisque came and I'm so excited to try it and I wanted to try it in front of you guys. John said it's good. Very so I've already started to dig in, but here is dinner. And you have dessert, and I'm so dang full. I think I'm literally feels like it feels like the food is like too into my throat. I'm so full. <laughs> and he is literally so cool too, but we're gonna try and wolf it down. There you go. <laughs> Dinner was delicious. Um, I am so full and I don't even know why I'm like that full because I feel like I didn't even eat that much today to be honest, but <laughs> I'm stuffed. But I am now back in the room. I came back here by myself because John's heading upstairs to get some water and go outside for a little bit. Um, and then we're gonna get changed around in our swimsuits and go in the hot tubs, but um, I just got back into the room and look at what is on the bed. So I opened the door and I saw this beautiful towel animal. Oh my gosh, he is so cute. I don't even know what he is. Like a penguin maybe? I think he is a penguin. I have to get a picture of him. Wow, that is so sad to see on day two. What the heck? No, but oh my gosh, I love this. It's so cute. I cannot wait to take off my heels though and take off this dress because I'm so like bloated because <laughs> I'm so full. It's gonna be so nice. So much better, oh my God. <laughs> Okay, this is probably so stupid, but 
Um, I had my, I used my straightener before dinner and um, I set it on the bathroom sink to uh, cool off. And we, I just noticed um, coming back into the room that our stateroom attendant literally wrapped the cord up for me. And I just noticed now too, he did the same with my phone charger. Um, and our shoes were kind of like strewn about the room and he literally put them all like neatly in a line on the side here. I'm pretty sure he folded those. I don't think those were folded before. Makes everything all nice and organized. Like, oh, he's so nice. I'm doing a little photo shoot on my phone, like a self. One with like my timer because John is not here to take the pictures, but I kind of like my hair like this. Like I think it looks good. Cause usually I have it parted over this way a little more and like it sits so flat like on my head cause my hair sucks, but got a little volume going on. I like it, I think it looks nice. One minute, 37 seconds later. So we've made it to Sorrento's right after dinner in the main dining room because this one over here is cray cray. So this is what it looks like. So nice in here. So cozy with the um, with the booths. I love it. And then out there, it's so hard to see, but out there is they've got live music and it's the prom god deck. We've got live music and the captain's out there. And they're serving free champagne, which we don't need because we've got the drink package. So yeah, yeah. I love it. It's so easy. I wish I could introduce you to all the crew members uh, on board because they are the really captain. important to me, all of them. But uh, of course we don't have the time to do that. And stability is also the chief of police on board. Alright, so we are seated early for... I believe it's comedy. That does not look like a comedy back background for me to me, but wow. Oh.